Now the first few weeks of, of the school year is going to look different than expected for some Cobb County students. The new East Valley Elementary School building was expected to be completed by the start of the school year, but the school says it's being pushed back about two months. Paul Lucero explains what families should expect once the year starts. East Valley school students were expected to start their school year at this new building on Holt Road. Instead, they'll have to do so at their old building down the street and transition into the new building after fall break. The librarian's already packed up tens of thousands of books, computers, electronics. Now the librarian and their, his or her staff have to come back in here early, unpack the entire library, reinstall all the computer systems, all the technology, only then to pack it up six weeks later to move down the street to the new school. This video from Cobb County parent Russell Sauve shows that packed up library at East Valley's Lower Roswell Road building. Nothing will be moved though until October 2nd, which is when the district projects the transition into the new Holt Road building will happen once construction wraps up. Well, I think it's a big disruption to the learning process to begin with. You're gonna have brand new kindergartners, kids who are new to the school come in. You're gonna be told, this is what we're gonna do. This is the systems we have, this is how we learn. We're going to scrap all this in six weeks. We're going to move down the street. And we're going to show you all new things. In an email sent out to the East Valley School community in May, Principal Whitney Spooner says this delay is due to supply chain issues and writes that while the timing is not ideal, the construction team says it will complete the project as soon as possible. Sauve, a former East Valley elementary student whose daughter also attended this school, pushed for the construction of this new facility. He says the 13 trailers where students went to learn were old and overcrowded. The first one was placed here when I was actually in second grade here and I'm 47 years old and that trailer is still on property and the trailers were uh, moldy. In a statement, a Cobb County District spokesperson tells 11 Alive in part that while East Valley students will begin the school year in their current building, they are looking forward to the new state-of-the-art building when construction is completed. Salve says he's looking forward to this new building too but adds that the timing is inconvenient. So are these teachers going to have to come back during their fall break and move their supplies over? Are they going to have to give up their vacation? The new more than 136,000 square foot school which is funded by SPLOST funds, will have nearly double the amount of classrooms than the original building and will accommodate more than 900 students. In Cobb County, Pavel Cerro, 11 Alive News. Right now